Kenya's push towards sustainable transportation has received a significant boost with a $10 million loan from the U.S. International Development Finance Corporation to e-mobility company Basigo. This investment is set to expand Basigo's electric bus fleet, solidifying the nation's position as a leader in green mobility in Africa. Jasmine Omboy reports. With over 500 reservations from bus operators in Nairobi and an additional 300 from Kigali, the $10 million loan from the Development Finance Corporation, DFC, is a shot in the arm for Basigo. This financing package is expected to create a surge in production, creating 300 green manufacturing jobs at Kenya vehicle manufacturers, contributing to Kenya's green industrialization efforts. Uh, we are currently producing, proud to produce, in partnership with Kenya vehicle manufacturers, five vehicles per month. Uh, our goal is to be raising that to 20 vehicles per month uh, in the coming months, with the overall aim of delivering 1,000 electric buses here in Kenya in the next three years. During a visit to the Kenya Vehicle Manufacturers Plant in Thika, where Basigo is assembling its electric buses, U.S. Ambassador to Kenya Meg Whitman has underscored the importance of the partnership between the U.S. and Kenya in advancing green industrialization. Very excited about EVs. I mean, EVs are the future of, I think, Africa and the world. Um, and green industrialization and green jobs have got to be a big part of Kenya's uh, growth and um, generation of, of good jobs. So we're doing everything we can to be helpful and relying on great entrepreneurs and uh, great manufacturing technicians and uh, companies and, of course, the financing arm of the U.S. government, which is DFC. This investment is part of a larger $250 million financing package announced during President Ruto's visit to the U.S. aimed at boosting Kenya's e-mobility sector and supporting the country's broader development goals. Why we're interested in this sector is we think it has the potential for sustainable growth, for job creation, for better movement of people. I mean, how great is it to be on a bus that's not super noisy, that doesn't have, it's not emitting black smoke? I mean, we think this is improving the quality of life for Kenyans, and that's our mission as the U.S. International Development Finance Corporation to finance projects that improve people's lives. Early adopters of Basigo's electric buses include operators such as City Hopper, Super Metro, Embassava, Metro Trans, and the Kenya Bus Services, KBS. Jasmine Wamboi, Citizen TV.